Hi everybody, habari, uh, ni hao, salu, konnichiwa, um, wherever you are, hola, it's good to see you here uh, and it's good to have you. My name is Lucy and I welcome to my channel. <laughs> Today we're going to be talking about a whole lot of things but um, if it's your first time um, it's a good time to take an opportunity to take a look at these videos and see if you like them. Uh, they might help you learn a few things, laugh at a few things and definitely get to know a few things on your travel. So welcome Karibuni and let's continue. So today we are going to talk about the common interesting phrases that people ask or questions that people ask while they're on safari or when they're coming to safari. Uh, but before we get into it, here's a few things that we probably should take note of while on safari. One, do not be the funny guy or don't try to act smart. What happens is that some people feel like maybe they're coming from a country where they can hold guns or hunt and they think they know better. No. There's a reason why you have the tour guides and your trackers there. So don't try to be a smart guy. You will get mauled by the animals. So now let's get into some of the questions that are commonly asked. One, can I pet the animals or can I play with the animals? You are not visiting a zoo, so please respect the wild. In the hierarchy of the wild, you are food and they are the hunters, so you cannot play or pet with the animals. And you cannot adopt or take any with you. So keep in mind when you're asking this question next time. Number two, are there bugs in the wild? You are going into open space that is called the wild. Yes, you will get bitten and eaten by all kinds of bugs, mosquitoes, uh, flies, and all kinds of other animals. So pack your bug spray and bring any insect repellent that you might have. It might be good for you to wear. Um, do you need bear repellent? No, you do not. <laughs> Okay, so let's go. Number three, can I wear my fancy, blinged out, bright outfit to show off in the wild? No, going on safari is not a time for you to create your Instagram moment. Bright colors will attract the prey and you will become food. So please follow the guidelines on what to wear before you go into the car and go on your safari. Number four, can I feed the animals grass or whatever it is that you think you might have snack in? No, again, you are not in a petting zoo, so please, please respect the wild and do not try to feed the animals. It's a dumb question. They do feed themselves, so they will take care of that. Number five, can the hippos eat me? Now. <laughs> They might be big and scary or might look interesting, but they do not eat people. Hippos are vegetarians, so they feed on plants <laughs> and they will not be eating you. That is putting it as simply as I can in terms that are more common to you. Now, number six, do elephants have teeth? Um, do they? I don't know, maybe go back and Check with your first grade teacher and see what that question's answer would be. Uh, number seven, do animals hatch from eggs? Now, you would think this is not a question that is asked, but people have asked if zebras or antelopes hatch from an egg. They're animals, they do not hatch from an egg. So please, please do not ask this question to your guides. Number eight, will we see the Lion King? Yes and no. Yes, you will see lions when you're on safari in Africa if you're fortunate to visit the parks that have some of the big five um, that house lions. However, you will not be seeing Simba that you saw on TV in Hollywood. So do not ask your guides if he is going to be part of your tour because he will not be there. Number nine. Who does the landscaping? Nine. <laughs> Who does the landscaping? Uh, let's see. Well, there's a few things here. Nobody. Uh, nature takes care of itself. So you might see some beautiful plains and you might see some beautiful grounds. 
doesn't mean someone's doing it. It takes care of itself. That's what happens when you let nature take care of itself. Number 10, do you speak African? Nobody does. <laughs> Just because you're visiting an African country doesn't mean there's a language called African. There's so many countries in the continent and unless you've invented the language, please do not ask this question because nobody speaks that in Africa. And a last one, when you're on safari asking the question, it might seem sensible to you, where is the bathroom? is actually not a smart question. You're in the wild, so you're not going to have bathrooms there, but you might ask a much better question, where is it safe for me to go while out on safari? And your guides will usually tell you at what points or what interest, uh, safe places it would be okay for you to get out the car and go take a bathroom break. Now that's it for me. Um, if you do have any more interesting questions or funny questions you've had, please share them in the comments and let us know what you thought. Um, have you asked those questions before? Is it something you were thinking about or have you ever heard somebody ask those questions? It'd be interesting to know. So let us know and if you like the video, please subscribe and like and we'll see you next time in the next video. Salut! Hello, bye, a bientôt. Quaheri. Quaheri.